Hello, today I'm going to be showing you how to make your guinea pig cage look cute. So this is my guinea pig cage and I think it looks pretty cute, but obviously you're seeing it when it's clean. So yeah, it's not gonna be clean forever. Guinea pigs are guinea pigs, hence the name pigs. Um, so it's obviously not gonna stay clean, but while it is, I'll show you what I did to make it look cute. So here we go. First thing is bedding. I personally prefer to use fleece because there's so many different patterns and colors you can choose from. And also I just find that it's less expensive and easier to clean. But more on the looks of fleece, it looks more put together and clean. And you can choose so many different patterns from the fabric store and there's so many different options. You can sew it or you can just set it down as fleece, but make sure you have something absorbent under it. The next thing is setup. Find a way that is convenient, but also that looks nice. Don't put all the houses in one spot. Spread them out a little bit. It gives your pigs some variety to choose from. Say one is feeling a little antisocial and wants to go in the other set of houses. Then they can do that without having to be stuck with the other pigs. As you can see, I have two in the middle and I have two on the other side. That's just what I prefer to do. Um, also, you can also use cardboard boxes as houses. I really like using cardboard boxes because it looks really cute and it's just a nice brown so it almost matches everything. The only reason I don't have cardboard boxes is because I share a room with these pigs and if I hear cardboard chewing all night, I will lose my mind. The next thing is something that goes on the outside of the cage. I like to use these lights, but you can also use a pom-pom garland or anything else that is pig safe. As that, I'm saying it's high enough so that they can't reach and chew on. I really like these lights because they look super cute in the dark and they just look very twinkly and I really like it. Next thing is toys. Try to find a toy that you like in your cage and also that your pigs like. My pigs prefer natural material to chew on other than anything else I've ever put in the cage. They really like all these toys. Next is a clean cage. And no matter what your cage looks like, it's going to look a thousand times better if it's clean. And that is something that I really like to do. I actually like cleaning my cage because it's something I can do and I get to interact with my pigs. I really like cleaning it because they can come up to me and then when I'm done, it looks nice and then I can let them explore. Even if you don't like how I decorated my cage. I know that there's at least one thing that we have in common that we love to see in our cage is happy guinea pigs. And as long as you rearrange their hidey houses once in a while and give them something fresh and new to explore, that's exactly what you're gonna get. And also, on Saturday, I'm going to be posting an introduction on my new guinea pigs that I will be getting, and also a cage tour soon. So be ready for that. Thank you for watching, goodbye.